A new study done in 2022 found that Americans in pain seek God. Part of the study focused on prayer. That in what, During the advent of the COVID-19 pandemic, prayer was one of the most searched words on the internet. What does prayer do? How does it work? Others found that during trauma, psychologists seek a greater, are given a greater amount of spiritual questions, both for good or for bad, because the trauma drives people to seek God. Pain makes people look for God, but often we look in the wrong place for answers. Psalm 119. Before I was afflicted, I went astray, but now I obey your word. Pain is God's megaphone. A Christian writer once wrote that, that that pain causes us to snap to attention, to pay attention, because pain forces us to look for answers, to seek why the pain is happening. However, the affliction can't be alone. Psalm 119 told us that. We need God's word. Only in God's word is our suffering given purpose. In God's word, we hear how Jesus suffered and died for us and for our sins. And so in Jesus, our suffering becomes one of two things. Either it's a way that God calls us back to him, stands us up to attention, keeps us from going astray, or it's a way that we can be like Jesus, suffering given purpose because we are suffering just like he did. Either way, our affliction brings us to God and to his word.